Welcome back. Chiropractic doctor Nikessa Remy joins us with tips to prevent common winter injuries. Good morning. Thanks for joining us. Good morning. Actually, th just walking outside this morning would be an injury. Well, what if extremities fall off? <laughs> That's true. I, I don't know if I can help with that, but I can't help with other things. Yeah, like frozen shoulder. Yeah. That's really common because we're often putting on, taking off heavy jackets, and that can affect our shoulders. So if you notice that your shoulders are getting stiff, a couple easy exercises to do, you just need a table and a couple towels. Forearms go on the towels, and you're just sliding forward. That's going to help to increase the range of motion in your shoulder, helping to limit or unfreeze any type of frozen or stuck shoulder. Okay. That's a great one staying at the table here, if your elbow is bent 90 degrees and you're just bending forward. So you're using your body weight to increase the range of the motion of the shoulder without increasing too much pain. So a great way to unstick or unfreeze those frozen shoulders. Okay, I'm following along by the way. As you just, <laughs> yeah. So uh, shoveling can be uh, dangerous in a number of ways. It really can. And a lot of the injuries just come from the fact that we don't warm up. We get up, it's snowed, and we head right outside to shovel. You need to warm up. So a really easy exercise that you can do to warm up your hips is just to go into like a lunge position here, thrust your hip forward, and you just go up and down about 10 times. That's going to help to open up the hips as well as get your legs ready for all that shoveling. Okay, and, and what's a, a proper shoveling technique? My technique is observing from the window. That's uh... probably the safest way. <laughs> <laughs> I have a nice neighbor. If you have to grab the shovel, you always want to think about your hips. You want to not bend at your back, but bend your knees and stick your butt out. So you're using more of your hips. And as you're pushing the snow, think about thrusting the hips forward. So the motion really is all in the hips, not the low back. When you start bending at the low back, you're going to increase spinal pressure and eventually cause pain. So really think about using your hips. Okay. Um... We might have some uh, lingering injuries from uh, Christmas time putting up lights, but uh, you know, just in these cold temperatures, it's easy to get neck injuries working outside. Yeah, so if you're out there taking down those Christmas lights now, you want to again warm up. And all you need is a towel. One of my favorite exercises to warm up my shoulders and neck, towel over the head, and I'm just going down and up. And you're doing that about 10 times before you get out to the Christmas lights, just to warm up. And then another really easy one is just holding the towel here and going up and down. So you're really preparing the shoulder and the neck for overhead work. Okay, and of course, um, with these temperatures, you know, it's, it's just important to protect ourselves too, to prevent any kind of uh, injuries. Might be bad for your business, but you know, to prevent visits to your office, you know, uh, there's all kinds of things we can do just to prevent slips and falls. Yeah, make sure you've got the right shoes. The more grip, the better, and layer. Colds can really tighten up muscles and make you more susceptible to injuries. So make sure you layer up before you head outside. Yeah, and, and do you find that's a, a thing during the uh, winter months uh, with your patients uh, because our muscles are so tightened up with freezing temperatures that uh, injuries are more common? Absolutely, because when we're cold, our body's natural response is to tighten and protect ourselves. So our neck, our shoulders are under this constant contraction, which does lead to a lot of neck pain, rib pain, shoulder pain. So it's definitely a busy time at the office. Okay, well, we appreciate you taking time out of your uh, busy morning. And uh, we're going to link up all your socials at chch.com. Chiropractic doctor, Nikessa Remy. Good to see you again. Happy New Year, by the way. Yeah, you too.